John, what the hell happened to you? Oh, I don't want to talk about it. Ow. With me now. This isn't the first aid kit from the uh, kitchen. Use other people's antibacterial cream? Please, I might as well give myself a staph infection. It's antibacterial. That's what they want you to believe. But you're using it. Shh. Looks like it's gonna bruise. Uh, I'm, I'm sure it's gonna be fine. It's... How do you know how to do this? Bruno used to get into these fights with this main coon on the 37th floor. Pumpkin. No, I don't need. I don't need tissues. You sure? Put them down. Are you gonna tell me what happened? It's New York. I got jumped. Did you call 911 to have the police come and ask a million questions about a guy who they're never gonna catch? No, thanks. You knew him. Let's just say that actions have consequences. Okay. I get it. Yeah, I get that. We're gonna talk about that box you were carrying? Oh, man. What box? The box full of personal things from your office. Like you said, actions have consequences. Jessica fired you. Mm -hmm. She asked me to stay. She did? Yeah, because she knows that I would never sell out this firm. Well, then I don't understand. What do you I have to spell it out for you? You're Harvey's right hand. He hates me. So, Jessica's the boss. But come on, Harvey's always hated you. No. Actually, Harvey hasn't always hated me. We were never Elmer and Bugs. We were Ralph and Sam. Who? Ralph, Wolf, and Sam Sheepdog. The cartoon characters? Yeah. They came to the meadow every day to work. Friendly. But then when they punched in the time clock, Ralph would try to steal the sheep, and Sam would stop him. I mean, it was brutal. And then they'd punch out again. Friends. And that was me and Harvey. Harvey's not punching out anymore. And I can't walk in here every day knowing that I'm gonna be working side by side next to someone who despises me. I just, Mike, I can't. Lewis, if actions have consequences, then maybe actions can redeem you. Oh, it's too late for that. Die's already been cast. Here, you can send me a new tube of arnica, your convenience. You don't have to stay, but I have some merger projections that I have to go through for Harvey, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be out of my depth. Morning. Thought I'd get in early and destroy Allison Holt. How's that going? It's a work in progress. Mm -hmm. Lewis's letter of resignation found it on my desk this morning. Good. No, not good, Harvey. We can agree to disagree. We're not agreeing on anything. You pushed Lewis out the door. It was not your call to make. Lewis may or may not have helped Allison, but he has betrayed you, me, and this entire firm. We're better off. If you really believe that, then something's got you off your game. Jessica, I'm not No, my... not you, me. Your job is to help me. And when I say you are off your game, you say, how do I get it back? I went to Lewis to get him back on board, and you made an end run around me. When does it stop? We can't let Trent go with Allison. He's gonna get screwed. I'm, I'm sorry. It's nothing. Uh, it's, uh, it's just some stairs and you know, stuff. So. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. I, I, I didn't see her there. Who did this to you? I'm fine. You're not. And after I'm done kicking his ass, the guy who did it isn't gonna be either. Harvey, just let it go. That's not who I am. I deserved it. What did you do? I don't want to tell you. I wouldn't call this getting your shit together. I don't want to tell you because of the story you told me about your mom and your dad. You got off easy. I know. It's a bad deal. What, you reading between the lines? Because I couldn't find anything in the contract. Because the problem's not in the contract. You said it yourself. The deal's too good to be true. The financials don't support it. Wait, you get your MBA overnight? No. 
You went to Lewis? We worked all night. He didn't betray us, Harvey. He found the problem. They never wanted anything to do with Trent's company. After the deal, they're just gonna sell it off for spare parts. That won't get them what they paid for it. But it'll get them what they wanted. Trent. Exactly. Lewis figured this out? Trent's contract has the same problem as Lewis's. He's got a non-compete. They couldn't get him to run the company unless they bought his. Now Lewis wants back in. No, he doesn't. This is just his way of saying he's sorry. 